Lariat. One of the aspects to this type of match, which makes it so interesting, is that it can lead to the formation of unlikely alliances. Just another thing to have to worry about when you're competing against three other superstars all at the same time. Mark my words, Cole. These four superstars are about to embark on the fight of their lives. Oh, right to the jaw! There he goes, crashing to the floor. Back of the neck. Ooh, right in the face. Destroyed. This is not the place where you want to underestimate your competition. Absolutely not. Double underhooks. His shoulders are down. And the champ kicks out. So resourceful. Ooh, what impact. Kevin Owens may be in a bad way here. He comes into this championship match with a full tank of gas and ready for a fight. And I guarantee you, the other three guys see the predicament he's in and are thinking of ways to capitalize on it. This match is so evenly contested right now that it's almost impossible to pick a winner. I guess we'll just have to settle in and enjoy the action. And he's heading back in. What a stomp. Good grief. Ring rattling. To be a success at this level, gentlemen, you have to believe in yourself. And when I look at Bobby Roode, I see a superstar who simply oozes confidence. Uh, I think this is the beginning of the end. But did he go for it too early? Things just went from bad to worse for Bobby Roode. What grace. Float over and absolutely spiked. DDT. As Corey noted, Rudy's is a guy who thinks quite highly of himself. But Byron, some might say his level of confidence is bordering. He might have it. Now, you got to believe this one's over. Is that it? Is it over? He's on the ropes, and the ref wisely stops the count. This might be it. Oh, my. Knocked off his feet. Now, that's a takedown. I saw EC3 backstage earlier tonight and asked him what the name EC3 stands for. He said, and I quote, nope, and walked away. Oh, what a <laughs> knee. Oh, what impact. A bad place to be for the challenger. He's definitely starting to feel the pressure of this fatal four-way match, guys. Looks to me like he's on Dream Street right now, Ouch. fellas. That's not a place you want to be when you're in the ring with these three guys. Michael, I commend you for trying to find out the origins of the name EC3, but this is a guy so deluded, he probably doesn't even remember what EC3 actually stands for. Oh, Byron, my inside sources have told me what EC3 stands for, and I will tell you, EC3 means he's better than the two of you and doesn't need to answer any stupid questions. Now, let's move on, shall we? Hey, dude, Byron, I want to ask you, with Kevin Owens' agility, size, and swift movement, who does he remind you of? Well, dude, Michael, the first superstar that comes to mind is the legendary Bam Bam Bigelow. Opponents would see Bam Bam's physique and expect one strategy to work, but Bam Bam was... Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. And comparing Kevin Owens to Bam Bam Bigelow, Byron, you bring up versatility. What can an opponent do to try to keep the prize fighter one-dimensional, Corey? Cole, the most honest answer I can give you is... You can't. Counter here. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Oh, targeting the stomach. He's looking at it. Kevin Owens just threw a nasty impact. There is no coming back from that one. Here he goes. Since the moment he returned to NXT, he's still... <laughs> This one is over. Things just went. He's got the shoulders down. Incredible, EC3 is the new champion. Here is your winner and new WWE Atlantic Champion, EC3. Nice victory here tonight for EC3. Wow, somehow he made turning